This 26 Sports and CCTV High School Football presentation is brought to you by Cadillac Casting Incorporated. All right, welcome back everybody to the post game show on 26 Sports and CCTV. Dan Gustard along with Bill Dooley and we just uh, witnessed a, an exciting game here in Cadillac as the Vikings defeated the Alpena Wildcats 14 to 13 with Tip Baker sealing the victory with an interception. And uh, Dan, uh, maybe you can. Yeah, I'll thoughts, talk loud over the uh, school fight song here. Yeah. Uh, everybody's pretty excited here in the home stands. Yeah, Vikings tough, tough 14-13 win here tonight over a very deep and tough Alpena football team. Game started uh, with kind of a scoreless first quarter, a lot of early early game mistakes, I'd say. 24-yard um, TD run by Noah Cochran. He's a sophomore here for Cadillac um, with 9.42 to go in the second quarter. And then uh, Libby kicks the PAT, and it's 7 nothing Vikings. Um, Alpina, the hearts, with hearts of a champion, respond right to that. Drive down the field, use up about five minutes a clock. Strong running by uh, Mr. Schultz and Mr. Guthrie. And uh, then a little crossover. Uh, Bob Sheldon gets a TD run. And uh, Wisniewski puts it through the uprights to make it 7-7. Seven Heading into the uh, halftime, that's the way it ended up. Um, early on in the third quarter, um, on a fourth down in uh, a whisker, yeah. from near midfield, Bob Sheldon breaks <laughs> loose, goes all 48 yards for the score to make it 13-7 uh, to seven at that point. Mm -hmm. um, the PAT was blocked by number 50 for the Vikings, uh, Mario Cerno. That turned out to be a the huge point of the game. The point of the game. The point of the game was that blocked PAT, and uh, congratulations to Mario too, as uh, being one of our uh, our um, player profiles. Player profiles. So uh, into the fourth quarter we go, after a huge defensive stop by the Viking defense. Um, they take over with 8:25 to go. Um, they uh, move down the field survive a penalty inside the Alpina five yard line which uh, would have been a fumble anyway a um, couple of plays later they punch it in the end zone and uh, Lloyd puts it through to make the score 14 13 Vikings Alpina does what they do best start driving the ball methodically down the field um, you know 348 to go Vikes D comes up huge um, was that the play by Tip Baker? That was the play by Tip On Baker. down. Yep. Stopping Logan Guthrie. Yep, at the 40. But Alpena does get it back. They, um, you know, Cadillac gets a couple of first downs in there. Yep. And then uh, with a little over a minute to play, they stop the Vikings on fourth and short, move the ball down <laughs> into the Viking territory at about the 40-yard line. Probably had time for two more plays when uh, Tip Baker steps in front of an errant pass and uh, – Steps out of bounds with the interception. The Vikings take a knee, and that's the way the game ended, Bill. Yeah, that's uh, one of the more entertaining high school football games you will see. I thought on the Alpena side that Bob Sheldon was a standout player for them all night long. I mean, just breakaway speed, shifty, elusive. I mean, he, he just did an awesome job. I mean, obviously, Logan Guthrie is an impressive player. Yes. Uh, but, man, when you watch Bob Sheldon, you're like, uh, there's, yeah. there's another player lot, right there. Yeah. And you know what? You got to take your hats off to that Viking offensive line. You oh. know, most of the ball game, they ran oh, yeah. left and ran left and ran yes. left away from uh, the, the the big guys of the Alpina yeah. defense. But not in the fourth quarter. No, they just said, you know what? We're going to put it right at you. And uh, that offensive line did a fantastic job. Yep. And then of course our uh, Gillette player of the game is uh, going to be <laughs> Tip Tip Baker for Cadillac, and and he, I mean, 
besides just running the offense flawlessly with the great pitches to Alex Barcheski, his running alone, hard nose running, and then what can you say defensively yeah. on the on the fourth down stop on yeah. uh, on Guthrie, and then the then the pick. Two minutes later, he's making the, the pick. pick to make the to yep. end the game. I mean, just one of those special nights. Yeah. And uh, you know, congratulations to Tip Baker on on our player of the game. So, uh, Dan, we want to thank you uh, tonight. You just did a great job. I love your analysis and uh, and humor. And uh, we want to thank everybody out there for watching. Our crew, Wyatt Van Dynen, Aiden Johnson, Gabby Long. Um, uh, where did, did Who we put it here? Uh, uh, Darrow. I'm trying to think of down on the field. Caden Darrow. Caden and, uh, yeah. Mar and, Sar and Sario. And Sar Sar Saranamo. <laughs> yes. <laughs> We're going to apologize to you as we kind of lost all of our paperwork up here as the cleanup crew yes, kind of we went through on us. We were doing Sorry it by memory. That. Doing it, it by memory. First day, wasn't it, out there on the field? Yes, it was, and they and did, he a, did a great job. They did a great yeah. job. So uh, uh, tune in next week as Dan and I will be covering girls' volleyball on uh, September 20th and then right back here September 21st for the Vikings and the uh, Godwin Heights uh, football team. So... Uh, for everybody and our crew tonight, our final score, the Cadillac Vikings 14, the Alpena Wildcats 13. Good night, everyone. Good night.